it seems that what is happening is, I guess, like a true Hunger Games. This has to end, and this can end only with one phone call, one, one person alone. This it seems is a war against humanity itself, and you can never win that war because humanity eventually will always prevail. We were in an area that is kind of a secure area, what they call a deconflicting area, that they were targeted systematically, car by car. So this was not just a bad luck situation where, oops, uh, we dropped the bomb in the wrong place or, or no, this was over 1.5, 1.8 kilometers with a very defined humanitarian convoy that had signs in the top, in the roof. The deconflicting was clear, the route was clear, the communication was clear. Prime Minister Netanyahu, 200 humanitarians have died already. Tens of thousands of civilians have died. Uh, I'm so sorry, but I, I think one humanitarian life is one too many. One, one children is one too many. We are seeing one of the worst moments of humanity. Uh, it's very complicated to understand that we are going to be sending America is going to be sending its Navy and its military to do humanitarian work when at the same time weapons provided by America not, not to defend Israel itself from missile attacks but use weapons that are killing civilians in this moment. I think America has to do more to tell, to send Israel a very clear message.